early morning again. About to set off. Horrible smell of electrical burning from inside the car when I opened it this morning. From last night. I don't know what it is. I'm hoping. It seems to be coming from the back rather than the front, so I'm hoping it's my dodgy rewiring on the stereo. And if it is, uh, that's cool. So all I'm going to do is not use the stereo and uh, crack on, but I've got to keep that off because it's, it's making me feel sick already. Right, properly plodding along now. Temperature looks okay, it's freezing cold outside. I'm just doing 50, motorway's clear at the moment, so I ain't bothered about that. Nurse it all the way back, come on. We can do this. I'm gonna stop off in a minute and see if there's an alternative ferry from Spain, see if anyone cancelled their ferry. If they have, I can save about 600 miles, which I think would be a, a, a good thing for the car. Prevent your car. Because he's tired. the windows that needed a bit of heat or a little bit less cold whichever way you want to look at it and uh it's also you smell not too bad at the moment but there is a new smell i smell radiator yeah it definitely smell radiator temperature is going up i'll check it in a minute going on. I have a sneaking suspicion there's something up. <laughs> I might have an idea what the electrical burning smell was and why I can now smell the radiator. I don't hear a fan. Normally when it gets hot, stop. <laughs> nice cooling down motion. I don't hear a fan. Stopping is bad. Temperature goes up. Driving is good. So a quick recap. Starter motors on the fritz. Radiator isn't working properly. Fan isn't working. Uh, we've got all sorts of fumes coming in the cabin. Why are the windows open? Uh, I want to fried the electrics. Apart from that, only a thousand miles to go. Good news though, tracking's brilliant. Hey! Yeah, no wheel wobble. I'm doing 60. Hey! Come on, come on. And only five hours to go till I get to my next stop, which is in Granigac in France. From there, I think I've only got about six or seven hundred kilometers to go until Roscoff. Okay, things have changed. I said earlier that the fan is not working. So the fan's not working. The radiator is full of gunk. I've had to open up all the doors on an adventure car so that the exhaust fumes and the smell from the radiator and the burnt electrics aren't coming into the cabin anymore. But there is good news. And the good news is, I don't have to drive to Roscoff. I've managed to get onto a ferry from Santander. So, they go at roughly the same time. This one goes to Portsmouth. That means a couple of hours drive into Santander, get on the ferry, arrive in Portsmouth, a couple of hours driving back to Devon. Rock and roll. I think it can make it. It's in limp mode, but I think it can make it. Hey, 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 hey. See you in the future. Thank mm -hmm. you.